guys, welcome to another video. Um, today I wanted to show you some new stuff I've got. So this is kind of a haul, um, new things. Um, most of the things I've already been wearing um, and I just wanted to show them to you at some point in the video when I have gathered a few things so it's worth, it's actually worth making a video. So I have some fashion items and some beauty items. I'm gonna start with the fashion items first. So the first thing I got, which I'm really, really excited about, um, and this is gonna this is gonna be something for my summer holidays, and they are those Sam Elman um, Chi Chi sandals. And what I really, really like about these, first they have a really thick sole and they're kind of soft. So I don't like sandals that are completely flat. So these are kind of cushioned, which I really like. And then I really like the color. Um, this is a rose gold kind of color, which I think is gonna look really glam. I ordered these online from the US and they came pretty fast. And I really like them. Then I got another pair of shoes. I got some shoes for work. So these are them. I really wanted some new, nice, cool shoes for work and ones that would be kind of comfortable. I saw those ones at Jones and they have kind of a wooden heel and a little wooden platform. And they are really, really nice nudie color. Um, they are size five and a half. And they are from the brand Gabor, or I don't know how you say that. Well, in Austria we say Gabor. And they are known to be like an old ladies kind of brand but when I tried them on they're really cushioned here and you know they're very flexible and they felt just amazing and they come a little bit higher up in the front so your foot feels really secure and even though they're quite high but they have you know a little platform and I really love them, I think they're really really nice and I think it was worth worth investing some money. And the last fashion item I got is this little cross body bag and this is from Massimo Dutti. Over the front. And I've been eyeing this up for some time because I really really like it and I think for when I go on summer holiday this this a little bag is going to be really really nice and it's real leather and it was on sale so it was a bit cheaper it still wasn't really cheap um, but it was on sale and I think it's a really nice little cross body bag they might actually have the shoes and the bag still um, in sale if you want to check them out and now I'm gonna go on to the beauty items there's a couple of things I got. So first I got the Clarins Natural Lip Perfector. Um, there are three colors. I got the color number 01. So that's the pink one. They also have a nude one and a peachy one. But to be honest, once it's on your lips, you can't really actually tell what color it is. You know, it comes with that applicator. And as you can see, I used it quite a lot. It's really weird. Um, I understand why so many people like it. Once you put it on, it feels amazing. It's really soothing and it smells really nice and it makes you kind of addicted. And you can't really put your finger on it, what exactly it is that makes you love it. You just know you really love it. So I really, really do like it, especially when, you know, during, my, during the day, my lips are a bit dry. I always have this in the pocket of my coat, that's how much I love it. And then I got a few more lip products. I have three of the Chubby Sticks from Clinique. Um, I got these when I went I got these when I went to Austria and they all came in kind of a promotion pack and it was really good value at the airport. So I got all three of them. I have the super strawberry. Um, the Whopping Watermelon and the Mega Melon and so far I really like the Super Strawberry and the Mega Melon and they're really nice on your lips, they have a nice sheen um, 
they give a bit of color they actually give more color than I thought they would and they last quite long but after sometimes your lips do get a bit dry so this is when that comes in handy so after a few hours of wearing those six hours and more because my lips are really really dry so you know once the gloss wears off and they just get a bit dry so that's when that comes handy and then I also got the Laura Mercier um, caviar stick eye color in Am Amet Amethyst and it's one of those um, kind of sticks that you just sweep on your eyes and when I swatched it in a shop I really really liked it and it was really really pigmented and it wouldn't come off my hand so um, I decided I would buy it straight away but when I actually took it home and um, the first two times I applied it after about five hours it creased really bad and this is supposed to be like one on its own I don't really want to work really hard with it so um, I started wearing it with a primer and that you know kind of works really well so it doesn't crease till the end of the day but it's a really really beautiful color I kind of have a love-hate relationship with this the color is amazing and it has really nice shimmers and it really fits me but you, when you blend it out the color goes away a lot so it's more like a see-through wash of color with loads of glitter which still looks really really nice but yeah I was for the price of this I was hoping I don't know maybe I'm just being difficult but yeah I have a love hate relationship with this if things don't crease you know really fast on you then you try it out they're lovely colors so yeah, I'm still going to use it, um, it was expensive enough and I still like the colours, I, I was just hoping it was a bit more, had a bit more punch if you want to say so to it. Um, next thing I got is the MAC Strobe Liquid Lotion, I really like this, I bought this after I saw Dustin Hunter's video on how he gets his kind of glowy look on and he just rubs it in his hands. Um, in that area and then just dubs it on like that and I just love it so yeah um, I can't complain about this I think it gives a really really nice glow it's a hell of a lot of product in there so that will last me like forever and yeah I love that so I'm happy I bought that then I also bought this which is the Nuxe Ref de Miel lip balm for dry and chapped lips yeah and I really really love this so thanks Denise for recommending this um, it's really really nice and it's really weird because it's really matte when you put it on and the smell is just amazing I love the smell of this I don't like putting it on overnight just because in the morning it gathers you know it gathers on the edge of my mouth and it feels a bit weird like kind of sticks together but I really like um, wearing this during the day especially putting it on before like lipstick or something because it's a matte finish which is really weird and it's quite tacky so it kind of makes a lipstick you know go on really nice so I really like that I'm happy I bought it and then Oh, before I show you my main really cool thing, I just wanted to throw in something else that's not fashion and beauty related and it's that. Yeah! I'm not even sure if I'm allowed to show books on YouTube, but I got this. Um, they sold it um, outside a little stand. Um, where I work outside of Wait Waitrose and I've been watching all his like I've been watching his show and I got really excited and um, yeah I think Chinese cooking is something I wouldn't do often and now I really got into it and last Sunday I actually made that and it looked exactly like in the book and I was so proud of myself actually posted a picture on Facebook, you know, like showing everyone. It looks exactly the same. And I'm gonna cook some more out of this book today, so I'm quite excited about that. 
completely random thing, but yeah, now to the main purchase of the week. Da, 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 da. It's beautiful, isn't it? I really like the bag. It's such a nice um, sturdy paper. And um, yeah, I'm speechless. So yesterday um, we had a little meet up. Um, even from Girl About Town 18 and Denise from Denise in Makeup and we went for lunch and shopping and obviously we got all hooked at the Burberry counter because we wanted to check out the eyeshadows which I actually didn't get one um, I got something else instead so I got the Burberry Sheer, Sheer Summer Glow Natural Highlighting Compact and I have it on my face today. So I have the, I show you, hang on, let me just take it out first of the packaging. I just wanted to show you the packaging as well. So it comes in a little pouch and this one is actually a cream color. And then you take it out and it's such a nice packaging. It's really heavy feeling and it has the little Burberry on here and it's called natural highlighting compact palette and um, I'm wearing it today so it has four colors in it and so if it looks a bit messed up because I already used it oops that was the plastic so what I did today <clears throat> um, this is all I have on on my face, so I even used it as eyeshadow, I used it as a contour, I used it a bit as a blush and as a highlight. Um, I don't know how good you can see in this video, but I really really like it. So it has two brown colors on that side, a dark one, a lighter one. It has a highlighting color and a pinky highlighting color. So what I did is used the Real Techniques contour brush um, because it's small enough to pick up each of the colors individually so I used the brown color and just contoured with it and just you know put it around my hairline and the colors are really sheer but you can build it up to an amount where you think it's dark enough which I really really like so if you you know go in a second time it gets a bit darker so you can slowly build it up so it's not like you would have loads of color on your face once yeah and then I used also the the darker brown all over my lid and I think it's a very nice subtle eyeshadow and yeah the reason why I wanted to buy this instead of an eyeshadow is because it has like four colors in it and although they're not as pigmented but I think you know, to play around this would be a bit more fun. So I used the brown color all over my lid and then I used the white, the kind of light shimmery color on my cheekbones, down my nose and a little bit all over. And then also again with the Real Techniques contour brush, I put the pink one just like on my cheeks like that. I think it's really, really pretty. It's very subtle, but it's really, really pretty and I'm happy I, I got this. It gives you such a, like, looks like you glow from within. So I really, really like this and I'm happy I, I bought this. And then um, the lady was like, oh, if you buy one more thing, you will get this gift for free. And I got all hyped up and was like, oh no, what else to buy? And so I decided to buy another thing to get the gift for free. And this is the... Burberry eye definer eye shaping pencil and this is what I'm wearing on my lower lash line so I'm not wearing any mascara I just have that eye pencil and I really like it it's kind of a square shape and it feels like so like luxurious really heavy and like this is like a kind of a metal cup which is really really cool and it also comes with a little sharpener how cute is that and it's actually one that will catch when you sharpen the the pencil it will catch all the waste 
it's just really luxurious and I really like it. And then I got a free gift, which was a little makeup bag. So the gift consisted of two things. So part one was that little makeup bag that says Burberry, beauty. And I thought it would come really, really handy when I go on holiday, so you can never have enough makeup bags. It has a little compartment here and has the checks inside and it's quite cute. And then part two of the gift was a little... And when I go on holiday, it would just be so neat to use those two together, so I'm really happy about that. And then... We ask her if she can give us some samples, so I got two of those little samples that comes with four little lip colors and then two foundation samples, which I haven't tried yet and I'm quite excited. So I already um, used one of the lip samples and the color I'm wearing today is blush number 09, which is that one. So I have that on my lips right now. Um, I think I'm going to be posting some swatches on my blog, so if you want to see um, exactly how the colors look like, then feel free to go on there. So I hope you enjoyed this video and see you soon guys. Bye!